Shrek the Halls was released in 2007 and was directed by Gary Trostdale. It tells the story of Shrek trying to discover the true meaning of Christmas and how to enjoy it with the family. When it comes to the Shrek franchise, I really love the first two movies, especially the second one. Shrek 2 is just amazing and the humour is just phenomenal. All right, look, lady. Don't you point those dirty green sausages at me. Shrek 2 is a film that is just tons and tons of fun. Shrek the third, though, we don't talk about that one. That one's horrible. However, on my last viewing of Shrek Forever After, I was really surprised by how much the movie grew on me. I would happily binge watch the Shrek trilogy now. As for the Shrek short films, I've seen scared Shrek lists in the DVD extras such as Far Far Away Idol, and I think they're pretty good. Now, I'm about to tell a fact that you may find actually shocking, but this is true. I'm just being completely honest. I have never ever seen Shrek the Halls before my life. I don't know, I just never watched it. So this was my first viewing of the special. And what do I think? I actually genuinely was surprised. I actually thought Shrek the Halls was really, really, really good. I would happily watch it again. In fact, I probably will watch it again. I thought the storyline was pretty good. It was very entertaining. There's a lot of good humor. There's a lot of good heart. It is very simple with Shrek's arc. We'll get to that in a moment. But I think Shrek the Halls had a very good story. There was a good message about family. It is very basic stuff, but the execution, I think, works. It makes it for a compelling story, in my opinion. So there's not a whole lot to say for the story, but for what it is, it's a pretty simple story. The pacing can be a little too fast at times, but then again, it is only 20 minutes. It's just, it does feel like the short goes by a little too quickly for me. The animation is very nice to look at. It's very colorful, especially the snow. The snow just looks gorgeous. It's just like, you know, for a short film that's like 14 years old, like the animation has hold up very well in my opinion. The characters were pretty good. Shrek's journey is, little basic with learning how to enjoy Christmas with the family, but it's a compelling arc, I think. It makes for some interesting dynamics. Donkey, Puss in Boots, Fiona, Pinocchio, Gingerbread Man, they're all pretty good. So are the three ogre babies. The characters are pretty good. They're pretty good for what they are. The soundtrack is even pretty good. So there's not a whole lot to say about Shrek the Hulls, but for what it is, It's pretty damn good. Overall, Shrek the Halls is a very enjoyable Christmas special. It has a good story with a lot of heart, nice animation, charming characters and a decent soundtrack. It's definitely a Christmas special that I'd watch again. I'm going to give Shrek the Halls an 8 out of 10. So yeah, I enjoyed it. After watching Shrek the Halls, I even decided to check out Donkey's Caroling Christmas Tacular. And I was quite surprised too. It is very short, it's only like around 8 minutes long. Well, I thought Donkey's Caroling Christmas Tacular was very charming and very entertaining. So that one was pretty good too. I hope you enjoyed this review. Stay tuned for the next video. Until then, everyone, skadoosh everyone and take care. And before the video ends, Christmas is coming.